that storm ripped up trees. Yep. I know nobody's out there watching me right now, and I don't care. Today was a great day on eBay. Started out selling uh, a Cutco spreader knife for $20. I bought it for $2. That's $20 in free shipping. And then a Grundig shortwave radio that I purchased about a month and a half ago for $2 sold for $30 in free shipping. No, and $6.99 shipping, I believe. And then I sold one of the best purchases I've ever made of my life today with the help of her. We were at Miracle Center Thrift Store the other day, two days ago, and we were checking out. We had bought a couple things, and she points over to this cabinet and says, hey, what's that? What's that? And I go, I don't know. It looks like a duck call. So I asked the lady, I said, can I get into the cabinet? And she's like, sure. So I grab it, and it's in an envelope or in a, a baggie. And it's got a sticker on it, orange sticker. Everything half off at that place at, with the orange sticker on that day. It, the sticker said $20. And there was some writing underneath it, and I didn't pay attention to it. So I was like, $20? So this duck call is $10. Well, I did a little bit of research on eBay, and I thought, oh, okay, it sells for like $65, $70. Well, come to find out, when I get home, well, actually, I looked at it, and it said it was a uh, Commander by Phil Robertson, a cut-down model. I'm like, oh, that's Duck Dynasty, and it's wood, so it's kind of old. And I saw it for like 65, 70 bucks, maybe. So I'm like, yeah, it's a good purchase. We makes a couple bucks on it. I get home and I do more research and I find out that actually only two in the last year have been sold on eBay. And one was like $190, $180 around there. And the other one was 200 and... 305. One sold for 305. So I was like, oh, I have something way better than $65. So I listed it at $350. I thought, well, if somebody bites, that'll be amazing. What a great purchase, $10 for $350. And, and then so today, about an hour ago, maybe a little longer, it sold and paid for 350 bucks. It's just amazing. That's why I do this. That's why I quit my job. You can't make that kind of money in one day working your ass off for someone else. You have to work for yourself and you have to keep your eyes open and your thoughts open, you know, thinking about different things that you can buy. I still sell stuff for five bucks and make $2 profit. I don't care. But anytime I can get profit like this, I'm excited. Well, good luck out there. See ya.